Hello everybody, it is I, Sakamoto. Here at it again with more Delta Room. Blubity blubity la da blah 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 doop boop 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 ba doop ba doop Exactly what she said. <laughs> Queen's Mansion, fourth floor. Alright. Back to this. Ah, Susan, return to feast upon my sprightly visage? <laughs> what? You look awful. Ah, such daddy. Is soon to my ears. <laughs> what the hell are you saying? How about a kiss for luck? <laughs> Stop mumbling. A kiss for me to change RNG? <laughs> what the hell are you saying? <laughs> okay. Alright, Birdly, you have fun in your denial stuff. Whatever. Bless your heart. Etc. 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 The night, <coughs> the night, the roaring night. Today it deigned to create this world, reaching its long hand to the sky. It caused its will into its blade, and made, thrusting the fountain from the earth. Unfortunately, the world they created is trapped within the confines of the library. If only we had a way to make more darkness, we might be able to cover the whole world. That is when I realized this power, this power of the will, this power of determination, is this not something that all lightness possess? If one was simply determined enough, could not anyone make a dark fountain? So then, if the night has taken its leave, then I will simply make a new one. Oh well, honey, darling, sweetie, gravy, how do you find the giant hand? Great, and how do you feel about world domination? Ooh, ouchie mama! <laughs> Sophie, you came to you came to save me. Somehow I I I knew you would. Uh, you did. Um, I mean I um well. Oh, wait, 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 wait! You need to get out of here. Hurry. Uh huh. <laughs> oh shit! We got giant mecha queen bot here. Queen? Seems that you failed to notice the giant freaking robot in the middle of my palace. I noticed it. Th this isn't good. She's she's invincible like this. Huh? She she's been bragging about her final form all day. <laughs> you think growing a few inches is gonna help? Yes, true. <laughs> oh no, not good battery acid. Are we going to take over the world now? Susie, let's just give up and... Hell, if we're giving up now. Su susie So what if you got another form? We've got another one too. Chris, Rossi, come on. Yeah, that's what I thought was going to happen. Wh what are you doing? This is our ultimate... Uh, well, wait a sec. Now that you mention it... Oh no, it appears I am evenly matched. I hope you won't mind if I don't hold back. Well, that didn't work. Uh, we're falling. Uh, Any bright ideas on how we're getting out of this one? Uh, oh, we could try flapping our arms? Fear not. Your knight in glow-in-the-dark armor is here. I'm guessing it's Birdly. Uh, Birdly? Yep, I was right. Chris, Susie, my energy is still too low to help you fight. So I found help for you. Behold, comrades! On your quest against Queen, you've made all sorts of buddies, right? Using our junk-making skills, we modified everyone to work together. I shall also take credit for this. Oh boy. Chris, Susie, behold! The ultimate group project! With a splendid base... Oh boy. Fla flashing lights! <laughs> Happy bribery. Meow noise. My energy. Squeak noise. 
Tender loving care. First cookie. Organization. And most of all, whatever this thing it is. Um, maybe I should have made that thing more powerful. Oh well. It's got a duck head. Of course the head is a duck. Oh, what the hell is happening now? This is cool. Finally. A what? Finally. A what? <coughs> Sorry, guys. I don't know what's going on with my throat today. Finally, a worthy opponent. Round one. Oh, this again? Okay. Oh, okay, never mind. It's different. Giga Queen blocks the way. Duck mode. We need TP for these. Better dodge. Sucky attacks. Heals 100. Oh, no. Okay. The time for work is over. Now it's the time to fight only. Okay. Oh, right. Forgot we have to attack. Uh. Oh, oh, just kidding, I totally look in my way and have to kick at the face. Whatever. Damn it. I still suck at this. And I don't have any butt juice. The time has come for the world to realize her own strength, her own will, her own determination. Uh... None of that worked. Great. I mean, my time must have been off for the first two or something. I don't know. Ralse advises you to dodge and counterpunch. Thanks, Ralse. You're the best. Dark Fountain. Then another, then another. Damn it. We're gonna die. We're gonna die. Excuse me, Master's the control is trying to punch more. How did I lose my TP? Then, when the world is covered in darkness, she and everyone can live in bliss, free of fear and suffering. Come on! Yeah, I got it. Hitting me. I have to do it slow. It's the only way I'm going to be able to win. <sighs> okay. Susie, bro, just be, just let me karate chop you and have, and you can have as many skateboards as you want. Really? Oh my god! How am I not dodging those? And Chris, my dear Susie, you can have as many... Okay, I don't remember what you like. Yeah, I got it. You have to wait till it's right on his face. It doesn't look like, you know, it looks like you want to dodge it from right when it's about to hit his head, but that's not how it is. Uh, okay. <laughs> I 
Okay, that's been me this whole time. Great, round two. How exciting. Join me and all of you have become super strong and cool. Meanwhile, I don't need to improve because I'm already I'm already perfect and can shoot lasers from my fancy glass. Yeah, I knew you were gonna do it twice. Oh man. We're at 117. Give me another CD bagel. Okay, I believe I've gained my point. I'm going to proceed to lead with my dialogue now. Good. Now that I have don't Then I don't have to mess up the dialogue anymore. <laughs> my My throat going out every time I'm trying to do this. Whatever. Uh, yeah, sure. The time for work is over. Now is the time to fight only. Okay. She just teabagged me. Uh, well, let's go. Come on. Okay, we get to do round two again. Good. Against his chest. Okay. Yeah, let's get so close to that rectangle.
know me, and all of you will become super strong and cool. Meanwhile, I don't need to. Yeah, we already read that. Hmm. I didn't mean to do that. Attacks got extreme. Why does they have forty percent HP? Whatever. Oh, I'm just kidding! I totally know. okay. We already read that. Okay. Thing that just happened. God damn it. Duh, and there's no mercy available. Chris, Susie, other guy, you have truly proven yourself to be a worthy opponent. You have the right to remember why you are fighting machines for true purposes. To get your own ass smashed. I need. With my final attack. Ha ha ha. Okay. Still hit me. Oh well. Do you think you're finished? Not this again. There's no way to dodge this. I have two extremely silver. Obviously, punch of a giant baseball so that one kind of fun. Well, thanks for telling me how to beat it. I, uh, I thought you were supposed to dodge. Huh. Why would she tell me how to beat her like that? Battle Dropping. Overheat. Activated. Listen well. You may have defeated me, but I soon possess one thing. You three will never have. Detachable hands. Oh no. <sighs> oh well. Darling. Honey. Sweetie. Let me guess, she's gonna say gravy next. 
baby. <laughs> That's what she said before. <laughs> Take the pin I gave you and stop the earth, creating a new supreme empire. I, I, what's wrong? Well, I know it would make you happy. Or should I put the last 1% of my battery? Crush city into eight pits. Leave. Leave Susie alone. You think listening to you makes me happy? No. I'll never be happy. Not if I'm controlled by you. Why can't you understand that? Oh well. Perhaps my computations were miscalibrated. No well. Disregard me and with your own power, choose the world that makes you happy. Queen? Oh, queen! Queen, are you okay? Seems you ran out of battery power. Guess we can seal the fountain now, right everybody? Everybody? Queen, she said, choose the world that makes you happy. I, I don't want to live in a world ruled by her, but if that wasn't the case, I wonder if this world wouldn't be so bad. Oh? Susie, don't you think so too? I, uh, now that you mention it, Chris, isn't this world just better? Make so many friends here, you know? I've never had an adventure like this before. Faxes and battles and magic. Healed with a little spell, and no matter what happens, no one tells us what to do. Gosh, yeah. So, so even if things were really scary just now, I mean, hey, it's Birdly. So, is there any reason not to? Not that I can think of. <laughs> Me neither. Then, Noel, let this be my real apology. Concentrating my will into this blade, I will make a new fountain and unleash a bright future. A future that shines for us. A future whose brightness is born from darkness. Stop. Aru? <laughs> what in the world are you all doing? Aru is Broadly's face. Well, uh, uh, stop. I mean, stop. Do you realize what will happen if you do that? I, well, just... You'll bring the roaring. Uh, what's that again? Or did they not explain it before? When the light is subsumed by shadow... Excuse me. When the fountains fill the sky... All will fall into chaos. Oh no, not chaos! <laughs> the titans will take form from the fountains and envelop the land in devastation. <laughs> the surviving darkness crushed by the darkness will slowly one by one turn into statues, leaving the lightners to fend for themselves. Well, that doesn't sound good. Whilst eternally in an endless night. Is that your idea of par paradise? I did not know that. You did it? But your whole plan was to... I'm just a computer, LFAO. I don't know everything. I was just guessing based off the night's actions. Why the heck, hell, would I want to end the world? Well, well, that's a relief. Uh, um, 
I'm sorry. I, I, after everything, I just caused trouble for you again, Noelle. That's okay, Burnley, I understand. I thought about it while charging my battery. You cannot calculate other people's feelings. You, you understand how I feel? Not really, LMAO. I just don't want Noelle to be sad. Uh -huh. well, I'm glad you two kind of get it now. Yes, we all made a pretty sweet team in the end. <laughs> no, we freaking did it. Can you let go of us now? Oh, yeah. Susie. Hey, you stood up to Queen. Not half bad. R really? Uh, yeah. Just guess you gotta wake up soon, huh? 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 Everything got so intense. I forgot it was a dream. Then I just hope I get to have more dreams like this. Hey, Noel, when you wake up, um, well, I just wanted to say, uh. <laughs> well, then I suppose that it's time for you all to exit. Running program tendergoodbye.exe. I will miss each of you. Noel? Your unneeded honesty. Susie, your foolish bravery. Chris, your chill vibes. Perky? <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't have to be goodbye, Queen. Chris can take you back to our castle town. You and all our recruits can live there. Oh. Cancelled. Deleting tender goodbye.exe. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, time to do what we came here for. <laughs> Hey, Noelle, if you see the real Susie, just, just know that maybe she's... Look, she doesn't have a tail, okay? Uh, okay, I got it. It's not a secret. Let's just go, Chris. Again. Huh. The Roaring Night. Whatever they are, they're making these fountains. But is that really a bad thing? Since they started showing up, everything's gotten a lot more interesting, hasn't it? Well, we don't have to think about that now. Chris, it's your turn. It was as if your very soul was glowing. Hey, we're back in the computer lab. Huh? huh? What? What happened? Oh, it was a dream, wasn't it? Huh? A dream? That was all a dream? Of, of course, that must have been a dream. Such feelings, such thoughts. Oh, sweet lady of justice. To think I would ever think Susie would be... Susie! S Susie? What, what are you doing here? Uh... Invited us to study, remember? Oh, oh right. Uh, uh, I. What? Studying with them? Oh well. Heavens to yikes! They're they're. Well, I guess we could try it. <laughs> huh? My my alarm? Ah, I'm going to be late for my shift with Miss Spoon. Oh no! How is it that late already? Well, adieu, everyone. I must gather my book longings. Ah, how I love the texture of freshly picked up books. Now, let us hasten, my dear Noel. <sighs> Good day, Chris, Susie. Bye, Chris. And, um, bye, Susie. Um, see ya. What? What? Are you looking for something? And nothing. Bye. The heck is her problem anyway? Way to treat someone who just saved the world. 
Chris, hey, wait a sec, Chris. We just actually saved the world, didn't we? Damn, we really are heroes. And no one even knows. Guess it's better that way though, right? People would freak out if they knew the world's in danger. Though it kinda sucks Noel has to forget too. Whatever, let's get out of here. Okay. It's a recycling bin. Looks like someone accidentally printed off a lot of useless emails. It's a computer. Someone tried to check their email, but the internet is down. It's a computer. The monitor is flickering brightly. It's a trash can. You get the feeling it doesn't have any friends. It's hard to explain why you feel this way about a trash can. It's a computer. The monitor is flickering brightly. The closet is spacious and full of old electronics. A large person could easily fit inside. There's posters talking about internet safety. You suddenly thought about how your day might have been different if the poster with that orange cat was still on the wall. It's full of many backup devices like extra mice, extra keyboards, or extra maracas. Ah yes, of course, the extra maracas. Can't forget about those. Before you left, you gathered up everything in the room. Um... Yeah, pretty much. Hey, who are you? I forgot. I love reading books, especially the book upstairs. It's book one about souls. Read it? Sure. The soul has been has long been called many things. The font of our compassion, the source of our will, the container of our life force. But even now, the true function of it is unknown. How to care for a human. It's a book for monsters on how to care for humans. Look inside. There are photos of unfamiliar humans inside. You shut the book quickly. <laughs> According to the card in the back, looks like your mother took it out repeatedly many years ago. Aww. Book of magic tricks. Most of them require orbs or floating hands. Lord of the Hammer. First in the award-winning fiction series by a lot of historian Gerson Bloom. I think we already read that. Let's just keep going. Man, it got late, didn't it? Guess you should go home, huh? All right, you don't have to say it. Don't want to walk home by yourself, huh? Well, if you're gonna make me, I guess there's one. There's at least one place I want to stop. Let's go. Should be this way, I think. No. I forgot. Yeah, the library is right there next to the school. Hoppus, Hoppistol. Uh oh, Alphys. Hell, if I'm going any further. Already close enough to getting banned from school. Don't want to be banned from outside of school, too. That's a thing, right? Oh, hey, Chris. Getting your project done? <laughs> oh, my bike is uh, totaled. I, um, I had a little crash. Or, er, see, there was a police officer, and it's complicated. How are you doing? Talk about school. Oh, how's your project going with uh, Susie? What, what? You went to the library together? Noel and Birdly? That's amazing, Chris! And, um, while you were there, this has nothing to do with me, but the Teen Zone seems to have some good, good anime reviews, you know? Not sure if you and the gang were just checking that out as you studied? Next, next time you might you go, you might want to casually bring that up among your fellow teens. Uh, I know your dad like me and you too, at least. Uh, again, nothing to do with me, uh, Chris, it's no secret the uh, police in this town are, uh, how do I put it, just, um, I can't even guess? Oh, wait, that came out wrong. I mean, they're symbolic. They barely do anything. It's because of the mayor. There, there, there isn't any crime. Makes me wonder if she even needs the police. But they're just g getting in the way. Yeah, <laughs> sorry. I'm just saying what you already know. After all, she's your neighbor, right? All right, I'll talk to you later. Let's go, Susie. <laughs> all right, let's go. All right, let's go. Uh, two bros chilling in a hot tub, right next together because because they are gay. <laughs> Nothing like admiring the great paint job that me and my bro did on our church. Mr. Spot. I'm not Jerry. I'm Terry. I'm super cool. I totally don't have to go to the bathroom. Oh, Terry, say it again. Say you don't have to go to the bathroom again. <laughs> 
if you guys don't know, I was referring to the Anthony Padilla vine. Yeah, you can just look it up. It's two bros chilling in a hot tub. It's pretty funny, but I changed the words, obviously. We tried to play baseball, but that kid kept dancing in the middle of the lot. I don't feel like there's any way to stop him. Having a wide open space is great for us kids. Sometimes it's good to get your freak out. Uh, okay. Put me in, coach. Put me in. <laughs> that, that bold guy keeps trying to show me something from his briefcase. Is it a bribe? I'm really deep into politics now. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. You're looking for the mayor. She's very, very busy preparing for the festival. Hello, if it isn't the teens, our beloved rats of the city. You want to get into politics? <laughs> you better graduate from diaper school first. That's what I did, and look at me now. I don't even work here. All right, cool. Uh, we're going to go back to diaper school. You need to make an appointment? Yeah, just here to hang out. I see. Okay. Peace. Maybe I should visit Noel's dad, see if he's doing all right, or if he's even still in here. Silver Drake? I've never beaten this boss before. All right, hand it over, honey. I got this. I forgot what his voice was, I'm sorry. No, Dad, this is my battle. So, um, how about just telling me what to do? Well, sure, how about trying fire shot? I'd love to, Dad, but the mage loved the party. Oh yeah, how about one of your 99 place potions? Um, I'm saving those? For what, your birthday? Come on, live a little. Okay, Dad, this one's for you. hi ya hi -ya. Yeah, hi -ya. It reflects fire attacks. Oh, ho, ho, whoops. Hey, you gotta heal. I wish I knew healing magic in real life. Then I'd make you better, and... It wouldn't just be me and Mom. Your mother is... Hey, it's okay, sweetheart. I'm getting better. Might even be able to go to church tomorrow. Really? Are you sure you're okay? Holidays happen whether you like it or not. Even though everyone likes holidays. Well, I'm gonna go home soon or mom will call. See you tomorrow, honey. How did you guys not notice me us yet? Bye, Dad. Love you. Susie, why are you here? Hell if I know. Because I brought her here. Sorry guys, this game's only one player. Um, Dad, this is, um, Susie. Oh, this is Susie. Susie, nice, heard a lot about you. You, uh, have? Cool, think I have to go now. Susie, huh? Yeah? Lay your finger on her and I'll kick your ass. Huh? Oh, just kidding. Well, kind of kidding. <laughs> Sorry, I <laughs> used up a lot of my energy just now. Probably not going to be very fun to talk to. Thanks for visiting, though, Chris. And you too, Susie. Hmm, current situation. <laughs> Seems like I need some more tests. Just gotta... So, so just gotta wait it out. They can't keep me down here for too long, baby. Sooner or later, I'm busting out of here. Besides, your dad ain't much without his main man. What is it, Christmas? Oh well. Look, Chris can't say much, but well, might might look like she has it all. But her mother, her mother, you know, love her, but she's tough on her. Normally I balance it all out. But I can't do much when I'm not there. But I'm gonna get better. I have to. What is it, Christmas? Susie. Hey, Chris, she's a nice girl, huh? The hell are you taking her here for? Why don't you take her to the movies? Hey, yeah, the hell didn't we go to the movie? What? The hell didn't we go to the movies, Chris? Yeah, and take me too while you're at it. Yeah, Chris, come on. Get a cord, Chris, big. Don't, don't skip out. Oh, man. Yeah, I gotta get out here and do something fun. Who's this? Looks like she's resting her voice. Oh, it's a Shiren. Hey, Chris, shouldn't we go check on my sir? You should be back in the school closet, right? Okay, fine. Go check on Lancer. I don't think it's this way. No, that's the way to Toriel's classroom. Whee! 
running in the hallways at school. Everybody's favorite pastime that they're not supposed to do. Uh, isn't this where we need to go? Oh, it's the other room. Derp. I'm a derp a derp. Uh. Hey, it's the queen. So, this is your castle town. It's not bad, true. Chris, Susie, on behalf of everyone I oppressed, thank you. I am going to be your wacky roommate now. <laughs> Beautiful. I love it. I'm so happy. Chris, I bet you have a lot of people to talk to, but you don't have to do everything at once. Save and take a break anytime you want, okay? CD bagel guys. That's 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 the, what they are to me. They're just the guys that sell me the CD bagels. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I know who they are. Uh, what were their names again? Captain Spark. Sweet Captain Sweet. Sweet cakes. Oh no, I really did. I'm not good with names. Mostly because like, not like I used to be. Mostly because. Um, I'm a huge nerd with a crap load of time on their hands, and, uh, um, hmm, how do I put this? The amount of fictional universes I have experienced in my lifetime is probably a lot more than most people have, to be honest. And I'm not trying to brag, but I've seen so many animes, read so many books, played so many video games, watched so many TV shows and movies. And because of that, and I remember, I have so many names in my freaking brain that it's just hard for me to remember new ones nowadays, so. Sorry, I don't remember. I, Captain Cakes, Captain Sweet, I don't know, I'm sorry. Please, please don't, <laughs> please forgive me. I've been training. Don't ask me, don't ask what I've been to training that way. What? Are you impressed? Great. I, I can kind of see you've got three leg, four legs now, or three bodies and one leg? I, I, I don't know. <laughs> Seems to be locked, it may never open again. This place is a great deal, all kinds of new customers. Want a free sample? Just for ninety nine to drive by to these clothes. Sure. It's like it costs money just to have a free sample. Who, who did this to my mannequin? Uh, as your prince, I, I demand someone fix this. Um, is, is anybody listening? I was listening. Don't yell. Don't yell that from across town. Hey, Lancer. Hi, Susie. I'm a worm. I don't understand taxes and values. Okay. We're building up the area to be a bit, bit more board like. The pond men will be happy too. Cool. Welcome to the music room. We don't sell anything. Oh, they just play music. Good song. Oh, we can... Oh, it's like a... Da, 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 sound test. I think we're gonna like it here. Cool city. As long as thanks, you can listen to all sorts of songs here. 
Don't think it'll be cheap though, it's free. What? Alright guys. Oh, I wanted the song to keep playing. Oh well. Hathi's <sighs> happy to see so many new faces. Happy, ha happy as Hathi. Ha what? Okay, that is what it says. <laughs> Mamma Miba, welcome to Top Bakery. Our special chefs spin baked goods at the top of their class. Mamma Miba, I was rejected from the cafe. What can I do now? Prize. Mamma Mina, as long as the purple girl is by your side, there will be no prizes for moi. Mamma Mia. <laughs> Mamma Mia. Who cares? Ralsei can, Ralsei can make me a cake. But, but my uniqueness as a baker. D d don't mind my pastries are a little extra salty today, everyone. Oh, come on. Whatever. Oh, ho, ho, I am Chef Lancer. Try my delicious hand-formed cookies. They are free for a price. What's the price? Zero dollars. Sure. I now pronounce you Cookie and Wife. Lancer Cookie was added to your items. Hells yeah. Well, hey, welcome to the to Top Bakery. I am this bakery smith, Malleus. I do not know what any of these strange tools are for, but using my skills, I can fuse items to create new ones. Um, well, I can't do anything right now, so don't worry about it. Chat. Red? What is this technique you speak of? <laughs> Your body is a weapon too. You must take care of it from time to time. Haha! <laughs> Let's feel my technique. Somehow, everyone's HP restored. Well, well, don't you feel better after a nice massage? Haha! <laughs> Alright, guys, that was fun. Talk to you later. Well, what a wonderful place. Thank you. This town, not that restaurant. It looks weird. I'm not going in. Okie dokie. Uh-huh, uh-huh. I wonder if she'll be back. Hey, boss. We're just reminiscing about fighting you. Hm. Aha, uh -huh, that's right. They took so long on their turn. What? A horned girl? I never got to see her. Uh oh they must be talking about Noelle. <coughs> you touched the light. You thought about how you can't go back to the cyber world anymore. Oh, that sucks. You consider this carefully. Oh. Well, whatever. What did that say? After a long day, the town has grown once again. You're filled with a certain power. Uh. Okay. I don't think we need to read manuals anymore. Oh, ho, welcome home. Things have changed again here in Sakamoto Town. Hey, boss, how can I help you? Challenge? Oh, man, I forgot about the challenges. Hey, this is how you can get a freaking club sandwich. Let's see if we can do this this time. Damn it. sandwich in the future probably but I don't know yeah I guess yeah cuz chapter 3 whenever it comes out Ah, 
Joey. Well, seems like you like chaos. So they're cutely. Yay, we did it. I just wanted the club sandwich, but what are the other challenges anyways? $250 for this. Okay. Hee <sighs> 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 welcome travelers. Oh, you sell CD bagels now. Yay. Well, I'm poor. <laughs> Mysterious hamburger heals 70 HP. Oh, that's the dark burger. You get amber cards from you. No, give me two of these, and I'm gonna go fuse them. Wait a minute. Actually, let's just do that real quick. Thanks. <laughs> Butlers. Oh, monsters, thank you for such a wide space to clean. The people here have such clean hearts as well. Sukiri. It's nice to make friends that like good clean fun. Sukiri. Interesting. I wonder where the clean is. Good evening, boss. Today's meal is crisps number E23D28. It's been deep fried with the finest JPEG artifacting. I hope it suits your palate. Er, uh, palate? Oh, yeah. Good evening, boss. We found a strange hooligan trying to turn the cafe into a second bakery. He was spinning and crying as my men carried him out. We do not predict any further difficulties. Now, please, you've worked hard, boss. Relax and enjoy yourself. For the young master, we recommend the blackberry tart. This way, even if you eat it quickly, you won't notice the stains. Okay. Uh... Okay. Seems well behaved. Boss, this cup... This cafe is so unrefined, so plain. Why don't we make it into an animal cafe? You can be one of the animals too, boss. <laughs> Lemonade, please. Hey, boss, I'll have a dark candy starfay. Nothing seems fine. Sure is great to be here with my best friend, Happy. No, I don't want to talk to you. I want to check the jukebox. The jukebox. Oh. 
Well, we got the CD dudes. Uh, I think we're done here. Maybe. Can we go this way? Oh, yeah. Newbert. Newbert's had a wild ride. Time to settle down. Give my riches to the weak. This one fall, I have ceased to be spherical. Newbert, you are one of a kind. Ho oh, oh, ho, who is this guy? He is scary. <laughs> oh boy, oh boy, I'm trashy. Ha ha, I bet I'm gonna make a lot of new friends. I hope so, trashy. <laughs> How about a strawberry cake as a room warming gift? Uh, There's a slice of cake in your fridge, Susie. Uh -huh. But it's not cold and fresh. Just down here again? Oh yeah, prison as prison as in there's banana lizards. I am not talking to that guy again. Okay, fine, I'll talk to him. You may have trusted me, but you'll soon face someone more fearsome, more tyrannical than you could ever imagine. <laughs> Queen, you already met her. What? Oh, nice hamster wheel. So you too have come to humiliate me. No, I am serious, it's cool. True. That water bottle, however. Do not speak ill of the water bottle. <laughs> it's nothing compared to the one at my mansion. True. Mm, materialistic as always. Materialism evaluation denied. I simply give myself the treatment I deserve. You slept curled up on a dirty throne every day. Enough, wench. What purpose have you here, Queenie Beanie? Just thought I would send a message, Kingy Wingy, that you don't have to worry about Lancer. I will be looking after him from now on. After all, I am his mother. When was that decided? Arbitrarily right now. Oof. Do what you please with that boy. But if he cries, bounce him on the ground like a ball. I think it is time to abort this conversation. As you wish. Oh ho, quite sorry, my king. Queen has a new man about town now. Who? Oh, who? Uh, I, I think I left my puzzle on. Posse's. I'm just gonna say him. Who was that, bro? <laughs> sorry, that was my son's lesser father. I cannot calculate someone less than you, LMAO. Be gone! Bye bye, Kingy Wingy! <laughs> that was really funny. I'm glad I actually came up and talked to him. By the way, did you want anything from the store? Cashews. Order processed. We have nothing to discuss. Okie dokie. We decided to dress as kings, it's cultural exchange. We're still behind bars for some reason, but it's okay, we're gonna love this hellish place where we dress as animals. It's violently protecting the jail. Okay, nice seeing everyone. There's a fun little Easter egg type cutscene thingy there. This maybe isn't the best thing in your room. <laughs> I don't know why we stole it and put it in here. It's a wardrobe full of all sorts of different clothes. You could wear whatever you want. It's a shelf. All sorts of keepsakes in yeah. Well, I thought you might want to keep it in here in case you might want to read it. It's your bed. It feels incredibly soft like sleeping on a dream. Okay. That was fun. <laughs> Jealous of my cool statue, Chris? Huh? What? No, it's not me. It's just cool. Yeah. Hell yeah. Jealous, Chris? So, uh, this was in the gift you gave me. The hell did you have this? The hell did you have this, Chris? Ooh, can I make it a little dress? Now I'm touching my doll when I'm not here! Uh. <laughs> I keep ending up in this situation. Can't say I'm a fan, or can I? Uh... <laughs> Susie, Chris, Toothpaste Boy. Queen is teaching me all sorts of things about being a bad guy. She's like, how do I put this? A third father to me. A girl dad, if you will. You mean a mom? 
Welcome, this entire castle is now my room. Well, um, I was going to set up something upstairs. Why, I already have everything I could ever want. Friendship, friends, and a small round boy. Now go and play with your friends, Peach Boy. Peach Boy, Peach Boy. Chris, do give Noel my regards. Any leftover regards you can give to Birdly. <laughs> That's great. Leftover regards. That's oh man, that's too funny. Okay, I think we're done here. Well, with the castle, and possibly with the whole town. Yeah, I think we talked to everybody. Let's go. Wait. Yeah, I visited the party dojo. I visited the bakery. I visited the cafe. I visited the shop. Do I want? Oh, I didn't talk to this guy though. Thanks for getting rid of the queen. Yeah, this form is much cooler, so I'm keeping it. Okay. And yeah, never mind, I don't want to go to the shop. Let's get the fuck out of here! Bye, Ralsei! See you next time! A little kind of sad and bittersweet, though, because who knows when we're going to be able to play Chapter 3. Alright, let's go, Susie. Unless you want to visit... The classrooms? Oh, hey, it's Timmy. Tim still steady. Steady harp. Tim get a smart. Go to college. Achieve dream. Then Tim become. Tim become. Ha ha ha. As if you could even envision it. Alrighty, Timmy. Nice to see you. Toyel's classroom. No one's in there. Let's go. La di da di da di da di da di da 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 Sorry, there's already some playing. What am I doing? <laughs> Holy crap. Sorry, my mouse thing was... Yeah. I had to clean it. I, my hand was sweating on it and I didn't know. Until then. Yeah, anyways. I just want to go home, but I'm still stuck in a traffic jam. Even though it's only one other person. It's this great parking place. I can see myself settling down here. The pizza sauce. Hey, the, we were able to get into the pizza place this time. The pizza sauce is boiling red, bubbling, burning like my blood yearns for battle. Ah! I, the warrior, shall show it the wizard's fist. Okay. Little buddy, you aren't gonna believe this. I've got a girlfriend, Astriel. You've got to tell Astriel right now. He's gonna be so proud of me. Huh? What she look like? Oh, uh, little buddy. How do I put it? I don't actually know. I haven't met her in real life. But from the way she texts? God, little buddy, she must be stacked. So far, she's the perfect girl, little buddy. She loves pizza. And bikinis. And to top it off, she sent me a picture. Of herself, wearing a pizza bikini. Little buddy, perhaps it is uncouth, but... Look, look at this. God damn! It's several pixels that vaguely resemble a zoomed-in JPEG of a pepperoni pizza. Yes, I know what you're thinking, little buddy. That you got catfished? Her camera is not of the highest caliber. But to a scholarly man of the world like myself, this is what love looks like, little buddy. Alrighty then. Try our new choc chocolate pizza. Melts in your pants, not in your mouth. Double ice pizza, great. Ice wolf, big customer. Ice wolf, maybe only customer. Hey, it's an ice cream guy. It's a soda dispensing machine. Inspect. You took a look at the flavors. Water, ice, double ice, bread, flame and hot cheese soda, gamer blood energy drink, juice, red flavor. I'd probably try the gamer blood energy drink just because it sounds interesting. And so does the, what was the last one again? Flamin' Hot Cheese Soda might be fun to try. Oh yeah, and the red flavor juice. Wow, my co-worker seems so energetic lately. I don't know what's happened, but seeing him make happy makes me happy too. Oh, a customer, would you like a blue saucer? Alright guys, that was fun. Oh, go in there if you want, but I'm staying here. Caddy's working there today, she hates me. So what if I took Jock Boy's hat once? I look cool. Jockington fans, they're crazy, man. Uh, I'm trying to. I messed up. Okay. 
Caddy's my Caddy's my friend, and I support my friends, though through thick and thin, long and short, cold and hot. Whatever shape the world takes, I'll be there. Oh my god, my little sis is so cute in her outfit. Chrissy, like, listen to the song I made about her. Caddy's the best. Caddy's the best. She curses me every day. Claire's because I'm in her way. Caddy's the best sister ever. Ha ha ha. Anyway, what's up, Chrissy? Talk more. Oh my god, Chrissy, you're not gonna believe this. I was at the beach playing ukulele, right? And, like, that green alligator evil neighbor girl, like, invaded and started, like, playing my song with me. Oh my god. Like, it was so fun. Haha. Uh -huh. Wait, isn't she, like, my enemy? This guy next to me, he's really bulked up. I admire that. I don't know if you know this, but I've been getting stronger. You could say I'm bulking up for the winter. Interesting. Hey, hon. How would you like... How did you like the hot chocolate? Well, I'm gonna take it. That means you enjoyed it. Take it easy, okay? I'm sure your brother will be back in no time. Sorry, I messed that up. <laughs> Woo, Caddy, you go, girl. Show those customers who's boss, little lady. Kick their touche. Woo, beat them down. You got this. Poor little Caddy. She's doing us proud. Working hard, supporting us, serving us pickles, terrifying us with their shape, trying to get us to leave. Proud of her. To tell you the truth, I thought this was the post office. But the time I real but by the time I realized I'd already sat down, I'm not hungry, so I've just been telling the waitress I'm still deciding for a few hours now. How am I supposed to get out of this one? Just ignore them. I know. They're embarrassing. Why are they even here? Because they care? Then they can care. Somewhere else. Then they can care somewhere else. What? Well, Golden hair, starry eyes, she is the light. Laughing in the night. Taught her protection spells. Showed her occult findings. But lately she slips into the darkness. Chris, you walk among the dark. Protect her. I'm Susie. I'm talking about Susie. Okay. What? Shockington. Pure boy, heart of gold. Curiosity high. Intelligence low. Fetish. Fetches, fetish, fetches frisbees, dress them up, carry in a bag, precious boy, don't know why. Family. Gad, mom, sister, ukulele, football games, soap operas, yelling, standing on tables, afraid of vacuums, stupid, loud, very loud. Chris, you and I, study the cult, together. Incantation for silence. Find it, tell me. Alright. Let's go, Susie Kins. Oh, we can go into Sans's grocery store now. Hells yeah. Various frozen bagels and treats. Mm -hmm. Hey, Chris, want to see if we can fit inside? Mm -hmm. If you just crouch down under the waffles, damn, I think someone's looking. <laughs> hey, hey, forgot something? Why, uh, yes. I think I left my eggs on the counter. Guess your memory's not what it's cracked up to be. Hee <laughs> hee. There is really egg on my face now, is there? Huh? Uh, you're excused. <coughs> Sorry. I'm just so happy to see these two talking right now and making jokes. <coughs> no. <coughs> Sorry. Hold on. I got this. <coughs> no, it sounds as if you are egging me on. You don't want to egg off. I, I expect a lot from you. Well, I'm exceptional. <laughs> and don't forget me, your egg's husband. Hello, Oscar. <laughs> Sans looks away. Tori, I didn't expect to see you here, but I I have some extra flowers, and I was wondering if... Oh, I was just about to go, actually. Oh, ha ha. Oh, sure. Home is where the heart is, ha ha. Um, so when Asriel comes home. Yes, we should all discuss that together soon. Okie dokie. Say hi to Chris for me. Of course. Have a nice day. You know what I want, Bone Man. Yep. <coughs> yep. Free pickles. Why, thank you. 
Can I ask, what kind of flowers do you think would make her remember how she felt before? Uh, maybe you should talk to your plants about that. Oh, don't worry, they're the first ones I asked. They're such good listeners, you know, flowers. Well, yeah, nothing like a captive audience. <laughs> Oh man, sand is trolling them so hard. Yes, uh, I can even I even keep them in glass. Uh, like that movie. Yes, it's it's very similar to that movie. Well, have a good one. Ho oh, ho, I'm trying. Hey, Chris. Uh, uh, never mind. Yeah, I'm the sicko that looks at all the milks to find the best expiration date. You got something about it? Mm -hmm. Hey, Chris, want to see if we can fit inside? Mm -hmm. if, if you just crouch down under mm -hmm. the waffles, damn, think there's someone, think someone's looking. Oh, we already read that. Icy's Pizza Pinups Magazine. Hot and fresh chairs, pepperoni, just like in your dreams. Okay. It's a zine for Jockington fans, seems popular. There's some car magazines on the racks. It might be fun to look at them. But there's other people around. It's a bunch of cards and heart-shaped chocolates. Get well soon. I'm glad your bike crashed. <laughs> Sometimes the hooked girl comes here, opens the freezer door, then stands in front of it, lost in thought. Guess she really likes the cold or waffles. That stuff is used half off. What is it? Crush. <sighs> of course. You can't reach the top, rendering it impossible to get a basket. You'll never be able to buy something in this state. <laughs> it's a rack of candy, jerky, and various nuts. <laughs> Sorry, guys. <clears throat> I need to have a drink. <clears throat> My throat's all getting dry. <clears throat> See? Jerky is candy and uh, peanuts, too. Actually, they're a lagoon. <clears throat> I think that's how you pronounce that. Peanuts? Jerky. Grapes, melons, oranges, and the scent of fresh pineapples. It looks like a normal basket of fruit, but when you reach in, it's incredibly deep and holds all sorts of things. It looks like a normal palm tree, but it's chock full of use useful groceries. Loose eggs, one dollar. It's too much responsibility for an egg. Mm. How about we don't look mm. at anything? That's gonna make him say something stupid. Picklings are looking slim, ma'am. <laughs> hey, what's up? See, brother. By the way, about my brother. Looks like you won't be able to meet him today. Yeah, it's a bummer when things don't work out. Sorry about that. I'm sure you'll meet him someday. Maybe around when your brother comes home. Okay. Well, thanks for letting me know that... Yeah, will happen at some point. Hey, what's up? Occupation. <laughs> Hey, you're the boss around here? Me? I'm just the janitor. Then where's the cashier? Cashier? We don't have one. Then who do we buy stuff from? Me? <laughs> <laughs> then that makes you the cashier. Nope, I'm the janitor. I'm just filling in. Are, you, are there any other employees? Nope. Then why don't you hire someone else? Whoa, you think I can afford that on a janitor's salary? <laughs> oh, right. Hey, welcome to the convenience store. You want to buy something, put it in a basket, and bring it here. In case you didn't know what a store was. Is that it? Maybe a day? Oh, he was going to say something else. Like maybe a day, maybe another two years. Who's keeping track at this point? Sorry, sorry kid, the brother thing's gonna have to wait. Hold on, okay. Okay, I just wanted to see if he would say anything else. Wait, okay. Some, okay. Do we read that already? Sometimes the hoofed girl comes in here, opens a freezer door, then stands in front of it, lost in thought. Guess she really likes the cold, or waffles. You kids came into the library, didn't you? Setting. How wonderful. Personally, I hate libraries, but... Faintly. Faintly a trussle. Growing further away. 
Knock, knock, knock. Ooh, is that a human? If humans are made of bones, where do skeletons come from? Funny. <clears throat> hmm, that knocking. It's amateur. You've still got a long way to go. Knock, knock, knock. Hey, uh, Chris, what are you doing? We're going to your house, right? I, I don't know what I'm doing, Susie. Like, little Chrissy, you hear? That, uh, guy at the pizza place? Oh, God, what was his name? Pizza Pants? Heard he got, like, a super hot girlfriend. What was her name? Like, uh, ha 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 ha, pizza, Rena? Ha ha ha, anyway, what, did you, like, want to talk? Sure. Chrissy, like, guess what? Today, I, like, went to the beach to play my uke, and, like, guess who's already there? That copycat playing the same song I wanted to play. Oh my god, cat on the beach, Grody. Did she, like, get lost looking for the litter box? So, like, I try to, like, play the same song, too, to, you know, assert my ukulele dominance. And we end up, ugh, get this, playing the whole song together. Like, oh my god, who does this girl think she is? She thinks she can just, like, harmonize with me? Ugh, I can't stand her. I'm sorry, but you guys, sounds like you might actually become friends as you were in the other universe. In this universe, too. Whew. Hey, Chris, this free milk is amazing. It's just, it just magically refreshes itself overnight. Uh, yeah, that's what it is. Um, hey, that's my trash from other people's houses. Like, privacy much? God, living with Azzy made you weird. Yeah, I'm weird, but you're the one collecting trash. Okay. Little, cr <laughs> little Chrissy, come to visit me in my alley? Ha ha ha, I'm a real alligator, aren't I? Talk. Oh my god, it's like so sweet you have a nasty, dirty little friend. But like, this is my polluted alleyway, so like, I think I might have to go to the mayor and get a traffic sign? That says, like, no plus ones, because, like, okay, all right, bye. Yeesh. That's all I can say about her. <laughs> okay, to the next part, right? Yeah, this way. Oh, hey, there's more stuff to explore. It's an arcade, it has been locked. It's a broken grill. It smells like burnt cat food. There's some kind of scratching and hissing from inside. Ribbit, ribbit. I sometimes hear beautiful singing from the house over there. How eerie. Could it be a ghost? My brother's too old to take for a walk anymore. Hmm. I'm aimless. Wish I had someone to whip me into shape. I wanted to buy flowers, but the store's closed. The door around back's unlocked, so... But I don't think I should go in. Oh. Oh, hey, 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 listen up. See that weird circle on the beach? Yesterday I waited on it and something weird came out. Of course, it's not yesterday anymore, so too bad. Well, I'll wait here for a second and see if anything happens. Oh, hey, something did happen. Never mind. Looks like they just sit there for a second if you wait. It's a metal picnic table. Damn it, my fingers won't fit through the holes. It's a metal picnic table. Yeah. What? 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 If you're looking for Blookie, they aren't here. Unless you're looking for someone else? You. Me? 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 What have I got to say to you? Nothing. Like, I don't even recognize a pathetic face like that. By the way, say hi to your dad for me. Wait, wait, don't do that. He doesn't know I... Nothing. Fine, fine, fine. You want to talk to someone else? Here. Oh my, someone's here to see me? It's you again, isn't it, darling? 
Oh my, why do you keep coming to our door? Are you a fan of mine? Haha. <laughs> as if somebody could... If, as if someone could be a fan of a nobody like me. Well, if you are a fan, haha, <laughs> could I bother you for a favor? Since the internet went down, I haven't... I didn't know it was Metaton until now. Since the... In I use my normal voice for him when he's not a robot. Since the internet went down, I haven't had much entertainment. If you have anything entertaining, darling, could you bring it by me... Could you bring it by me to... Could you bring it by to me tomorrow? It would mean the world to me. Thank you. Ribbit, ribbit. I sometimes hear beautiful singing from that house over there. How eerie. Could it be a ghost? Hmm. There's a cat flap. It's locked. Somehow. <laughs> it's a broken grill. It smells like burnt cat food? Yep. Guess we're going to my house now, Susie. Yeah, alright. Chris, you going home? Yeah. Alright. And guess it's goodbye for today. See you tomorrow, Chris. Chris, I was sitting with your... Oh, <coughs> Sorry. It's hard for me to do the high voices <coughs> sometimes. Why, Chris, is that your friend? Why don't you invite her inside? Uh, uh, I mean, I, uh... Chris, I should probably, um, get going, and... I was going to pick a pie. Did you want any? I guess I can come over for a bit. Feel free to come in. Oh, excuse me. I am Chris's mother, Toria. <laughs> yes, ma'am. I, I remember. Oh, you do? And you are Susie, are you not? <laughs> huh? You, um, remember my name, t too? Of course. Miss Office is a good friend of mine. She often talks about you. <laughs> um, glad to hear it. Chris, the hell is Alpha saying about me? Susie, why don't you wash your hands over there? Then we can make the pie together? Make it together? Uh, but I don't know how to. Do not worry, I can teach you. Okay. Chris, Susie seemed like a nice girl. I'm very happy you were friends with her. Chris, I... Heard from Alphys about her behavior. If by any chance she er, influences you, er, leave the chalk alone, alright? <laughs> Hands uh, washed. Wonderful. Now we can. Oh, Chris, how about you show. <laughs> Me? How about you show Susie how to bake it? <laughs> Chris, you want to know how to make. You know how to make pie? The hell haven't you made me any, that dumbass? You pie-hearting piece of... <laughs> I mean, uh, excuse me, ma'am. Susie, you can just call me Tori outside of school. Oh, okay, sweet. Huh, Chris? Oh, you need to wash your hands, too. And I suppose I shall teach Susie for now. Susie and I will start getting ready to make the pie. Uh, we will? Wait. It's a sink. You could wash your hands here, but isn't the sink in the bathroom better? Sure, let's go there. Run the tap. It started to run. It's making a lot of noise. Uh oh. Chris, are you okay? No. Don't tell me. Oh, what is he doing? He's doing this again. I'm uh, guessing he wants to eat all the pie again? Question mark? Is he just gonna leave? Or are they just gonna leave? Brother. 
Cool. Let us get the flower. So that's this bag, and you just. Oops. Hee hee hee. Susie, you have flower on your nose. Uh, I meant to do that. Thought you would stop to smell the flower, eh? At <laughs> uh, you. Come on. No, on to the next part. So, where the uh, uh, heck is Chris? Oh, Chris, uh, does this sometimes. Well, they should hurry. I'm getting sleepy. Do you know what they call a sleeping Susie? Huh? What? They would call her a snoozy. Uh, <laughs> then, then I guess you'd be a snorio. <laughs> snorio, snoozy and snorio. Uh, <laughs> you really like that one, huh? Wasn't it funny? Am I okay? All right, where the hell is Chris? <laughs> Torio? <laughs> the pie is nearly done. Oh, the sugar. Wait here a moment, I left it in the car. Okay. Okay. Let me guess, he's gonna grab his soul back out of the sink? Maybe not. Question mark? I'm so confused. Why is Chris doing this this time? I guess it's not to eat pie. But I can't examine the window to get any hints. The apple scented shampoo feels lighter than usual. No need for it. Your hands are clean. Hey, Chris, hurry up next time. We're already almost done. So what's next? Oh, uh, the pie. We already worked quite hard, have we not? How about we finish it later? Um, okay. Then, uh, guess I'll walk home? Oh, no, 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 there's no need to do that. Oh, actually, Susie, would you like to stay over? Huh? I mean, um, if it's okay, then... Here, look at this! <coughs> Our couch is used to, used to being used as a bed. It's not perfect, but we could all sleep out here. That sounds good to me. Yeah. Splendid. I will make sure everything is in order. Just call your parents, will you not? Yeah, of course. So what the hell, a sleepover? Damn, I haven't had one of those in forever. Hey, Chris, it's not like someone has to tell you to sit, right? There, chill out for a sec. So now what? I got it. Maybe between the pillows here? There, I knew I'd find the remote in there. You can always find good stuff wedged in the couch. Jesus, Dusty, when's the last time you used this thing? Well, who cares? Let's just watch TV. So what do we got a marathon tonight? Blood Crushers 3? Hullbusters? Invasion of the Cat Peppers? <laughs> Invasion of the Cat Peppers. <laughs> Maybe Ice E, the movies, more your speed, huh, Chris? <laughs> it's been a good day, huh, Chris? You, Ralsei, Lancer, everyone, it's just cool hanging out together, right? That's why, you know, don't you think we should try to have them come to our world? Come on, think about how much better it would be. Ralsei could do our homework, Lancer could live under your bed, we could all walk to school together. It'd be perfect, you know? I mean, we'd be unstoppable is what I'm saying. <coughs> yeah, let's do it. Yeah, that's the attitude. Ugh. What if Ralsei became a teacher's pet, though? Or not if, just feels like a matter of time, honestly. I need a drink. <clears throat> Sorry. <clears throat> I've been doing a lot of talking, obviously. <clears throat> well, whatever, as long as he brings me an apple, too. 
What? Apple shampoo? No, I didn't drink any of that. Well, whatever. Let's just get back to watching. Goes back to the cooking cat. <laughs> this is nice. So, the festival is coming up, right? That thing's become... That thing where the town becomes a carnival. Stupid, right? But say you had to uh, take someone, Noel or Rousey. Uh, Rousey. What? Why are you saying it so confused? It's not like I meant anything weird. You know what? Forget it. Look, let's just go back to watching TV. Now this is what I'm talking about. The giant monster movie special. Always like them better than the giant human movies. Now this is something we can marathon. Are you ready, Chris, for 12 hours of building, bashing, car crunching action? Because we are locked in, got it? <laughs> Better not see you move until your eyes are bloodshot. <laughs> well, let me just get comfortable here and... There. Falls asleep. Saw this coming. She said she was sleepy. Susie fell asleep. And she's snoring. <laughs> God damn. She sounds kind of like Little Nicky from, from, um, from the movie Little Nicky when he's sleeping. No, not nearly that bad, but kind of close a little bit. Oh, the lights mysteriously went off. Officer? Officer? What the hell? Thank goodness, I finally got through. I thought I saw someone crawling outside, and when I checked our car, Tires look like they've been slashed. Officer, if you could please come over. You will? Soon? Thank you. Is that what Chris did? <sighs> They're already asleep. Well. Is that it? There's probably more stuff that's gonna happen. Uh-oh. Here he goes again. Oh boy. Or rather, here they go again. Oh! I think I just figured something out about the main characters of this in an Undertale. The reason why they're like gender neutral and they go by they is so that you as a player can project your gender pronoun onto the main character. That's why I'm always calling him a he. I guess. It makes sense to me. I don't know. Okay, so what the hell was that? It's also why, you know, the same reason why Link never talks in Zelda, so you can kind of fill in the blanks with your own, like, thoughts and project what Link says. In your own mind, I guess, when you're playing Zelda. That's what the Shigeru Miyamoto said about him. I don't know, look it up. It's, it's, they, he explains it better. <sighs> Left us on a bit of a cliffhanger, didn't you, Toby? Man, this was epic. I don't know what else to say. I mean, there's no other words. I mean, that sums it up perfectly. That was fucking epic. Holy shit. When the next chapter comes out, I'm just gonna save my money and just get it. Assuming... Yeah, I should be able to do that. Unless it's, it shouldn't even be that expensive. Oh, it, if it's like 15 or 20, which it should be, then I'll be able to get it. Um, maybe it'll only be 10 if it's only chapter 3. Who knows? I should be able to get it. Uh, 
either way, I'm definitely going to buy it and play it when it comes out, so look forward to that. Wait, what did I do? Okay, I guess that's it then. That was the end of chapter two. Hope you guys enjoyed my let's play of Deltarune. Oh, chapter two. Oh boy, I'm stretching. <laughs> Oof, that was so fun. Thank you for watching, and thank you, Toby, for making this. Despite what you went through, apparently, uh, with uh, everything that happened after you made Undertale, I watched a video because I was curious, and this guy kind of explained it pretty good, actually. Um, I don't know who it was, but basically, like, from what I remember, Toby's reaction to how big the fandom became, it was just shocking to him, I guess, and it was like, I don't know, he said something like, I, I never thought this would happen or something. He, uh, anyways. Either way, I love these games. I love this game. I love Undertale. I love Lamp, etc. Thank again. Thank you so much for watching. I love you guys. You guys are great. You help me. Uh, I don't know. You help make this fun because I feel like you guys are like. I don't know how to explain it. You know how in a lot of fandoms. Um, it helps a lot of people when they're uh, maybe lonely or depressed or whatever to be a part of it. It's like the opposite for me. It's like uh, you guys, you know, make life a lot more valuable to me. So I appreciate that more than you, I can ever, more than I can ever say. Even though there's only like two or three of you watching this at this point, but I don't care. You make it worth it. Even if, like I said before to Gregory in one of my Undertale videos in the comments, having just fa one fan makes this worth it to me, so... Thanks so much, everyone. To everyone who's watching, to everyone who has watched, to everyone who will watch. Thank you so much. And, uh, next time on Dragon Ball Z... <laughs> I'm going to be playing I, possibly an Undertale fan game. I haven't played any of them yet, so that'll be new for me as well. Because uh, I'm kind of on an Undertale hype train. I'm enjoying doing all the different voices. and I think there's one called Memory I want to check out. So I might check that one out first. And uh, I may play it for 5 or 10 minutes before I start recording. You know, I'll just start over without saving and record from there. Or... I might just start playing and start recording, and then if I enjoy it, I'll, I'll upload it and stuff. That's probably what I'll do. That makes more sense. Okay, enough rambling from me. Thanks, guys. Thanks for watching. I don't know how many times I can thank you, but thank you. Love you guys. Oh, no, I pressed the wrong button again. <laughs> Have a great...